microprocessor is also called the chip. It acts as the brain of the computer and so many other electronic devices. The microprocessor has lots of little memory cells, each numbered with addresses, connected by wires and little microelectronic parts. The cells store numbers, but the numbers also represent other things. For example, a number can stand for a letter. Numbers in a row can spell a word. Here's my name in code. You see, that's why they call it code, because the numbers represent other things. Every bit of text, images, music, and even video as stored as a series of numbers. The instructions for a computer are called programs. The programs are also numbers. The programs tell the microprocessor what to do. They provide logical procedures telling the chip how and when to compute or when to move the numbers. The results are outputted. Output can take on many forms. Oops. The most common is on the screen, but can also be music or video or an action. All that math and logic is being computed by this tiny little device with little transistors, storage cells, wires, circuits, and miniature electronics, but with such big impact. It's kind of like our brain, but way smaller.